Hello students, I'm Hema and in this video I'm going to do question number 3 of exercise 11.2 NCERT class 9th maths. The question is construct a triangle PQR in which QR is equal to 6 cm, angle Q is equal to 60 degrees and PR minus PQ is equal to 2 cm. So first let us draw a rough figure. Let this be the triangle P, Q, R, where Q, R is equal to 6 centimeters and angle Q is equal to 60 degrees and P, R minus P, Q is equal to 2 centimeters. Here P, R is this side and P, Q is this side. So from this we can say that P, R is greater than P, Q. Okay, so now let's start with the construction. First draw base QR equal to 6 centimeters. QR equal to 6 centimeters. Now angle Q is equal to 60 degree. So with the help of compass, we'll draw 60 degree angle. Now with any radius, we will draw an arc which touches the line QR at a point and with the same radius, we will place the compass at this point and cut the arc previously drawn. Draw ray QX passing through this point of intersection. So this angle is 60 degree angle. Now since PR is greater than PQ, that is this side is greater than this side, we will extend this ray QX below QR. And since PR minus PQ is equal to 2 centimeters, we will open our compass equal to 2 centimeters, place the compass at Q and cut this ray QX below QR. Let this point of intersection be point D. Join DR. We know that the vertex P of the triangle PQR lies at any point on this ray QX. So to find out that point, we'll draw a perpendicular bisector of DR and the point where this perpendicular bisector will uh, intersect the ray QX will be the point P of the triangle. Uh, let us draw a perpendicular bisector of dr. To draw a perpendicular bisector of dr, we will place a compass at point d and with the radius greater than half of dr, we will draw two arcs above and below dr. Now with the same radius, we will place a compass at r and cut these two arcs above and below dr. Let these two points be m and n. So on joining these two points, we will get the perpendicular bisector of dr. And this perpendicular bisector cuts the ray dx at this point. So this point is point P, that is the vertex P of the triangle PQR. So this is the vertex P of triangle PQR. Join PR. To get the required triangle PQR. Now let us do the justification. Now in triangle PQR. QR is equal to 6 centimeters and angle Q is equal to 60 degree, right? And this is given to us. Now we have to prove that PR minus PQ is equal to 2 centimeters. And we know that 
this point P is the point on a perpendicular bisector of DR. Uh, we also know that any point on a perpendicular bisector will be at equal distance from the two end points of the line DR. Therefore, we can say that PD is equal to PR. So, we can write here PD is equal to PR. Also from the figure, we can say that DQ is equal to 2 centimeters by construction and DQ is equal to, this is DP minus PQ will give you DQ. So, we will write down DQ is equal to PD minus PQ. And here PD is equal to PR and DQ is equal to 2 centimeters. So, we can say that PR minus PQ is equal to 2 centimeters. Hence, the triangle PQR is the required triangle. I hope you have clearly understood this construction of the triangle PQR and its justification. If you have any doubt, you can ask me in the comment section below. It will be my pleasure to help you out in your doubts. Thank you.